Welcome to School of Civil Engineering. As we have started a AutoCAD tutorial series in English, so it is its at lesson eight, and in this lesson, I will discuss about copy, move, offset, and rotate option in AutoCAD. So, if you're new here, you can watch our previous YouTube uh, AutoCAD tutorial series that are already given in description and also they have many almost uh, 200 plus video are available in this channel about related to civil engineering so you can watch that if you think that it is helpful for you so let's uh, start first of all I'll open our AutoCAD software so now I'll show you about that how will copy some element suppose this is a circle sorry suppose this is a circle of 12 inch so I'll copy that circle so to copy that circle just press CO sorry press CO then enter now you will see here copy selected object so here select object so first of all we will select object then enter then it's showing copy a specified base point so we have to select here base point I mean with respect to which point we want to copy suppose if we if we want to copy from center then we have to click center then we have to move okay so we can move in any direction and here by stopping ortho mode you can copy it anywhere as you record you can copy it like that anywhere as you required okay now suppose this is a line I will open ortho mode this is a line and point will be in the center point of the circle I mean the circle of center point will be in that point so how will use that again CO enter then select the object I can enter especially the base point the center point will be the base point then we'll select sorry we'll stop ortho mode here like that suppose in here in this way we can or midpoint of it so in this way we can copy that suppose here then that point that point that point that point like that way you can copy that so now I'll show that how we'll move something so to move similarly M then enter I mean press M then enter it's showing select object suppose we'll move that so select that object and press enter specify the base point so you have to specify a point suppose I will specify that point then here we have to specify another point where we want to move so click here it's have been moved like that we can use our move okay so now if we uh, now I'll show you about that how we'll rotate a element suppose I'll draw a rectangle suppose this is a rectangle okay this is a rectangle and I will rotate that at a certain angle so first of all you have to press R O then enter R O enter otherwise you can click here R O so R O you can click here for rotate so R O enter then select object here it's telling select object so we'll select object then enter then it's showing a specific the base point I mean at 
with respect to which point we will rotate our that uh, uh, rectangle okay suppose if I select the that point then our rectangle will rotate with respect to that point so also you can give the angle here at which angle specify the rotation angle at which angle you want to ro rotate that suppose I want to rotate in 45 degree angle so press 45 then enter so this is the rotation with 45 degree angle now suppose you want to rotate suppose this is a rectangle and you want to rotate that with respect to some another point now uh, again arrow then press uh, select the object then enter suppose uh, with respect to that point we will rotate our rectangle then like that so we have to click here and like that we will be able to rotate our model so you have to give the value suppose 40 45 then enter so like that way we can use our rotate option now I will show you about the offset object so to offset them what is the first of all you have to understand that what is offset offset means suppose this is a rectangle now you want to just draw a, another rectangle out of it outside of it or inside of it with respect to certain distance or for a line so first of all I will see for that so to use offset press O then enter then it's showing a specify the offset distance a specify the offset distance then you have to give the distance suppose I will uh, offset it for uh, two inch okay then press enter then select offset to ob uh, select object to offset then we'll select that and move inside or outside move inside or outside so there have in uh, there another important things that specify the offset distance two inch okay so select the object just one click here not press the right button okay not uh, sorry left button just one click of left button and it has been selected then release that and move your mouse inside or outside at which direction you want to uh, make offset so first of all I want to make offset in inside so it's done so again if I want to make offset in inside that click here again again click here again again so like that way we can offset here you can offset any as you required now suppose I will draw a line orthomont then here now I want to make a li parallel line in 10 inch away so for that we will click offset offset then we have to give here 10 inch then select the offset here this is the line of 10 inch distance so if we want to see that this line to this line and it is sorry this is the 10 inch distance okay 10 inch distance so so here in this way we can uh, use our offset so I think it's clear to you that uh, how will draw or offset or how will move how will copy how will rotate our uh, elements in AutoCAD so in our next video I will try to show you with another uh, different uh, command that used in AutoCAD and if you think that that's helpful for you just press the like button and also leave a comment and if you have any question or any query just contact to me by pressing by giving a comment or through mail or if you think that that is helpful for you just press the like button and leave a comment your own comment and your own like inspire us for the next work and uh, if you think that this channel is helpful for you 
just stay with us so thank you thank you very much stay connected till next video